Hi, I'm Paul Sadler, CEO of Presbyterian Aged Care. We are in unprecedented times. The current coronavirus or COVID-19 pandemic is causing disruption unseen since World War II. We wanted to take this opportunity to let all our residents, home care consumers and their families and friends know what steps we've been taking to respond to the crisis. At PAC, we are running an essential service for older people and this is recognised by the government. It's just as essential as the hospitals, ambulances, police, shops or other services that must be maintained for our society to operate and for its people to be cared for properly. As I record this message, no PAC service has been directly impacted by a case of COVID-19. We want it to stay that way. And in order to reduce the risk of it happening, we've implemented a number of changes to the way we operate our care homes, retirement villages and home care services. First, we have conducted a refresher course on infection control for all of our staff. We've also made available additional resources to all our frontline staff, including providing them with advice about how to protect older people as well as themselves. Second, we are following public health advice to adjust how we run services to minimise the risks of spreading COVID-19. In our retirement villages, all group activities have been suspended. We are also making alternative arrangements for the budget meetings this month. We will communicate via letter or email or hold video conference meetings if necessary to try and minimise face-to-face contact. In our home care services, we have cancelled all group activities at our day centres. We are helping people over 70 to stay in their own homes and self-isolate by assisting with shopping. We have offered to help clients connect with their families via new technology like FaceTime or Zoom as well as to access telehealth services so they don't have to leave their home and risk exposure. We want to reassure you that you can continue to receive any service we provide that is essential to help you stay at home. PAC took the difficult step of closing our residential care services to visits by family and friends on the 29th of March. We know how much our residents value in-person visits by their family, friends and loved ones. However, reducing the number of visitors reduces the chances of COVID-19 entering the homes. We know this hasn't been an easy adjustment to make and we want to thank you for your cooperation. The only exception is in end-of-life cases. Knowing how much the visitor restrictions could increase social isolation, we've put on extra staff and purchased additional iPads at all of our services to help residents interact with their loved ones remotely using technology. The iPads can also be used to access telehealth services. Please be assured that when the government allows us to lift visitor restrictions in the future, we will do so. We will continue to act on advice from the public health authorities throughout the pandemic. So further changes to our services may occur, and if they do, we will notify you promptly. Finally, I want you to know that we are fully prepared in case someone linked to PAC catches COVID-19. We have a detailed COVID-19 response plan which is ready to swing into action should the need arise. We are also working with the government to make sure that adequate levels of personal protective equipment are available if we need them. If a case occurs linked to one of our facilities, we will implement lockdown procedures as per our infection control manual and work in conjunction with the public health unit. Our process will be essentially the same as during a flu or gastro outbreak. As a ministry of the Presbyterian Church, at times like these, we look to God's word for comfort and inspiration. We read in Psalm 55, 22, cast your burden on the Lord, and he will sustain you. We are keen to demonstrate the Lord's care for each of you in these challenging times. If we can help you in any way, or if you have a question for us, please contact us at 1800 722 679. Email us at info at pcnsw.org.au or reach out to your service manager. Our top priority is the health and welfare of our residents and consumers. We want you to know that we are doing everything humanly possible to protect you. God bless you all.
and keep well.